I mean, girl, just giving you body, body, body for days. I mean, damn. Goddamn. Oh, Lord. Cuckoo, what's up? Bienvenue, it's Khadija, aka The Muse, you know about it, and I am back. And this time around, this is for a pretty little thing haul. Um, like always, do not forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and let's get started. I bought all my items through ASOS, and the reason being is that um, I've never purchased on Pretty Little Thing before, and they don't offer free shipping. So they don't offer free, and actually they don't offer free returns. I don't mind paying for the shipping, and it would be nice that after like 50 euros or 100 euros that the shipping would be free, um, but they don't offer free shipping, nor do they offer free returns, and that is a problem for me, especially if it's a site I've never used before. I wanna have the, um, the security that if something doesn't work for me that I can return it. And obviously, yes, I can still return it, but first I already have to pay for the item. I have to pay for the shipping and now I have to pay for the return as well? No, ma'am. So um, I decided to go and purchase them through ASOS. And ASOS, obviously, it's free shipping either way, depending on how much you purchase. And I like ASOS and they had um, quite a bit of um, pretty little thing items. So obviously, they're probably not as up to date as, um, the Pretty Little Thing website itself. But I was like, you know what, it's all good. I'm gonna buy these pieces on here because I feel safe and we're gonna try it out. Everything is gonna be linked below so you guys can go copy these. And like I said, all these items I purchased through ASOS. And most likely you could probably find it on the Pretty Little Thing website. You'll just have to look around. But I'm really excited about these pieces that I got. And let's get started, okay. So the first item, we're gonna start off with is this dress. Um, so this is that dress that's ruched. Um, it's been on trend for quite some time. I got a similar one when I did my um, Boohoo haul, but that was terrible. It didn't fit me at all and it was just a hassle to get into. So this is it. So the lining, oh, somebody's tried this before. Look at this. Can y'all see this? I hope you can see it. So this is deaf. So somebody has tried this before. They didn't even bother to get off their damn makeup or whatever that stain is, but hmm. All right. But anyway, so this, I don't know what the price was. There's no prices on here. And with ASOS, when they send you the bill, they don't put the prices on here, so I don't know what it is, girl. But I'm gonna link it below. I think it was under 20 euros. Um, this one is in a size 34. Um, I think it will fit. I actually, yeah, we'll see. This one, unfortunately, I'm not even gonna bother trying to get into. I could barely, it fits a thigh. I'm gonna show you, it literally fits just my thigh. If I try to squeeze myself in here, it's gonna bust this dress. So I'm gonna just wait till whenever, I think even a bigger size than my regular size would have to be because I can't get this on. So let me just show y'all. Do y'all see this? This dress literally fits my thigh. Nah, ma'am. So I'm just gonna have a picture next so you guys can see what it looks like. But hopefully I can finally get this in my size and I could be able to um, rock it because I really want one that's this long. So the next two items, this is a bathing suit set, and I think both of them were 20 euros if I don't own. And if I'm not mistaken, I believe both of them are 20 euros. I'm actually really excited for this. So this is supposed to be, I think, like the Brazilian fit, like high waist, um, like bikini bottoms. I definitely am liking what I'm seeing. H&M has some that they're selling currently. So it's kind of, you know, giving you a little cut so your booty can like be poking out a little bit. But at the same time, you know, everything is like covered. Um, and this is a bra. So this is shaped like actual bra. Okay. So this is a bikini top that's basically a bra. And I got this in what size? So this I got in a size 36. I hope that'll actually fit. Um, I don't think this is my cup size. I didn't realize it was going to be a cup bra itself, but I got this in size 36. I think it'll fit. And the bottoms I have in a size 38. So unfortunately, I don't try on swimsuits here. So mm -mm. Um, I will try it and then I'll let you know what it's like, but I'm not going to like put it on camera. But 
I think it'll be cute. Next item, we have this dress. I love polka dots. Like, I don't do... Okay. I like polka dots a lot. Um, that's probably one of my favorite um, uh, mo motifs that stand out. Like, I do stripes and polka dots. Like, flowery, other prints, it's not really my thing. But polka dots and, like, stripes and... Those are my prints for the most part. So this, um, it's kind of cheap. Very cheapy dress. Very stretchy. Um, this kind of... <laughs> It kind of reminds me of Clueless. This is giving me Clueless vibes. This is short. Dang, where the hell is this supposed to go? This looks like a fucking nighty. I mean, we'll see when I try it on, but uh, this look real, real short. Like, my booty's going to be hanging out on this. Um, we'll see. We'll see. I have to make a comment about this. Hell no. Would I wear this anywhere? This is a nighty. This is so short. My booty is just, it's not, it's hanging. No, no, no. I'm not, like, voila, my booty's hanging out. Like, that's how short this is. Because, you know, when you got booty, the, the back is always going to ride up more. Like, how? How do you wear a dress like this? And I like the polka dots, but this is a hell no. How is this this short? I mean, Lord have mercy. I mean, mm. <laughs> Next item, we have, oh, I'm excited about this. I, oh, I'm excited about this. So this is a beaut, I love this color. I love the sage color. So this is an asymmetric, um, asymmetrical dress. It, I think, was like 20-something euros, between 20 and 30 euros. Definitely love the color. I think it's going to fit well. The material, it's stretchy, but it's not lined at all. Um, the material is quite cheapy. So we'll see. But yeah, I definitely love this color. Another dress. There are so many bags. Lord have mercy. Okay. Okay. Oh. Oh, okay. Um, so this is basically this. I didn't even realize I got basically the same dress. So this is that white dress in um, this blue color. I didn't realize this was the same thing. I thought maybe they were shaped differently or one was shorter than the other. I don't know. Maybe I'm mistaken. But basically, this is the same dress again, and we'll see which one fits the best. Okay, so this was a struggle to get on. It is a size 34, so it's not my size. There is no zipper entry. It's just you have to shimmy all the way down. This happened to me in my previous Boohoo haul, so dresses like this piss me off. But I actually like it, so this is exactly what I thought I was going to get. It is a midi-length um, ruched dress. Honestly, for me, if I were to wear this, I wouldn't wear it with the strap. I think the strap is cute, but I think it looks better um, strapless or with the straps to the side. So if I were to wear this, I think I would wear it like this. have some high-waisted shorts so this is um, I got this in a size 40 it's there's no stretch this is just pure cotton um, the cotton is quite thin it's a little rough it doesn't feel particularly soft but hopefully it'll fit it looks it looks good and it's actually a very it's like a pure white so it's not that like off-white color which I don't like when you get like white jeans and I believe um, those shorts were 20 euros <laughs>
this dress I'm excited for. Um, so this is kind of like, I guess, Pretty Little Things, their high-end pieces, if you could call it that. So, ooh, it's definitely heavy. It's a thick material. Okay, okay. I will give it to them. I would definitely say this is, um, it feels like a high-end high -end material. So, remember, this was like in the early 2000s, like maybe 10 years ago or so, when that um, banded dress was really popular. I think it, the brand is Herve Leger or something like that. I don't remember, but... This, I've, I mean, obviously I ain't never owned those, those pieces, but this is what this is giving me. Um, so this is a um, sweetheart neckline bustier dress, and it has a um, fishtail end. So this is um, midi length, I believe, or just past the knee. It, I got this in a size 36. Let me see. I got to see yeah, in a size 36. It seems like it's actually going to be a little bit big. I mean, we'll see, but this was on sale, I believe, for like between 30 and 40 euros. I think normally it's like 60 or 80, if I remember seeing that correctly. But yeah, I don't know about this color, but it feels like a good material. I have to comment about this a little bit. Um, I think this fits me <coughs> to the tape. Okay. However, the bust is quite, there's very a lot of space here. And right here, it bunches up quite a bit. Um, I think like here, this is perfect. But up here, I'm a 34 and here I'm 36. But, ooh, I mean, girl, just Giving you body, body, body for days. I mean, damn. Goddamn. Oh, Lord. Mm. Ooh. I mean, boy. See, let me, let me jump up on here so I can show y'all. Okay. So this is what I mean. It has that sweetheart or fishtail bottom. But I mean, girl. Girl. fits that's gonna be see-through um so this is a jumpsuit that i got i love a boiler room like jumpsuit i love a jumpsuit because it, it gives me like androgynous vibes and i really like that style um from what i'm seeing this definitely looks like it's gonna be see-through like i can see my fingers through this so hmm and the material doesn't feel very nice it does not feel nice it feels like one that would make you sweat it kind of feels like it's plasticky so i'm guessing it's probably polyester i thought it was cotton based um let me see actually what it is so this is yeah it's 100 percent polyester so it's just plastic um yeah mm, it has balloon sleeves so that's nice but i don't think this is gonna fit very well but we'll see and i got this in a size i'm um, 38 because you know these hips I don't even think it's going to fit past my hips. Maybe. It looks large. We'll see. We'll see. right so I decided you know because I don't really go outside my comfort zone like that to get this dress which from what I'm seeing oh 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 it's a maxi I didn't know it was a maxi the material is so thin yo like I can see through it 
mm -mm, I don't like this already. But um, so this is a maxi dress. I don't like it at all. It's ugly. I don't like the print. I don't like it at all. But I'm going to try it on anyway. Um, it has that little silicone strip here, so it'll actually stay on. Um, I don't like the material. It feels weird. I don't, yeah, I don't like this at all. I, I, I don't even know what the hell I was thinking. I, I really don't know. I don't know if, <laughs> did I order this for real? I, we'll see. I don't. We'll see. So I actually have to give commentary about this. I told you I hated it. I still hate the print. Don't like the print at all. It's just not my cup of tea. Um, however, it's not just a dress. And I know I, there has to be a reason why I picked it up. So the reason why I picked it up is because it is a um, jumpsuit dress. Oh, these things hurt. These armhole things are tight. Okay. So this is a jumpsuit dress. This is what it looks like in the front. I definitely, I love this cut right here. This is very cute. Um, if this was not in this print, I think I would keep it, but I definitely, I don't like the print. Item. This is a bodysuit and this is a sweetheart neckline bodysuit. Unfortunately, it doesn't have the um, that silicone grip that will let it stay up. So I hope that it will stay up. I like the shape of it. It's a thong bodysuit. I normally don't really care for thong bodysuits. I'm not going to lie, especially because the material is usually really thick. So you're still seeing panty line anyway. If you're going to make a bodysuit, like I think they should do the material at the bottom for it to be that, you know, that really thin microfiber material that doesn't show a panty line. That's what I would recommend, but you know, it's not my store. But this, I believe, was 20 euros or 15, 20 euros. And it looks okay. It is just partially lined just right here. So it doesn't, it's like maybe goes down four inches maybe. And then the rest is just kind of like this. But it doesn't look like it's going to be um, showing uh, BC through. So we'll see. Um, so this is a bardo dress. I got this in a size 10. It was on sale and it was the only size I believe that would fit me. No, actually, yeah. Wait a minute, what? Sorry, I got this in a European size 38. It looks quite big and it's very stretchy, so we'll see how it fits. But this was the smallest size that they had available. Um, I like the little trim, um, the details that it has here. Kind of like a corset trim. I, I do like that about it. Um, I believe this was like 15 euros, if I, memory serves me right. <laughs> Thing today from um, Pretty Little Thing by the way of ASOS. Um, like I said, I'm going to link everything below. Um, like always, do not forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and your girl will be back soon for a new video. So, peace out, bisous, and hugs. Ooh, 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 ooh.